Hey guys. Okay, so this is gonna be a short video and some of you guys are gonna hate how short it is because of what I'm talking about, but uh, it has to be short, I'm sorry. Oh, and you guys will be glad to know that I, so far out of my three classes, I've received two A's, so yay, it's been worth it. Um, so yeah, um, <laughs> how do I even start this video? Well, Summer got saved, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this past Saturday, um, I invited her and her family uh, to a Christmas party that my friend was having at her house, and they came, and so uh, when she was leaving, um, I was saying, hey, you know, it's nice to see you, and hopefully I'll see you again sooner than later, and she said, oh yeah, just let me know when, and I said, well, in that case, <laughs> uh, why don't you come to church tomorrow? And so they ended up coming to church. It was awesome. Um, uh, her, her husband, and a friend of theirs named uh, Danny, Daniel, uh, came to our church and visited the next day. And uh, we had a guest speaker that day, and he was really awesome. Um, Dr. Tim Lee, I don't know if you guys have heard of him or not, but he, every time I've heard him preach, he's been awesome. And so I'm really glad that they came. And, um, yeah, so, oh, Daniel, he got saved also, so, praise the Lord for that. Um, so I'm telling this story from my point of view, because <laughs> that's the only point of view I know, it's my own. And so, we were sitting in the front row, and, um, we had saved, uh, seats for them, and <laughs> I felt so bad, because, you know, uh, people were coming to come and sit next to us, you know, our friends and stuff. And uh, it was like, no, don't sit there. <laughs> so I felt really bad about that. But, you know, hey, God got the glory anyway. So, um, yeah, so we're sitting there and um, Dr. Tim Lee, he's, he's preaching a sermon on the lost. So how fitting. And um, he's talking about um, how how Christians should be burdened for their friends and family and coworkers and everyone else that they know that um, is lost, who has not come to salvation through through Jesus Christ yet. And so, um, you know, my husband and I, we're sitting there and we're, you know, we're receiving the message and, you know, I remember sitting there thinking to myself about um, the people that I've, I've been burdened for for and um, the people that I've been burdened for and, you know, thinking to myself that, you know, that there are some that I've been more burdened for than others and um, thinking to myself how I should be more burdened for the ones that I haven't been as burdened for and um, so all these things are going through my mind while I'm sitting here um, listening to Tim Lee preach and so... All of a sudden, I just I hear someone crying, I hear crying, and so um, I look over, and it's Summer. It's Summer crying. She's sitting on the on the end. You can't see where my hand is going, <laughs> but she's sitting on the the aisle in the same row that we are. You know, so I'm two seats away from her, and I hear her crying, and so I turn, and I look, and I was like, oh, hey, that's Summer crying, and so my husband got up and got the box of tissue and handed it to me and I passed it down to her and um, I don't think she took the tissue though she just you know she was having her own private moment with the Lord and um, yeah she was just crying like bawling tears and so uh, Tim Lee did the altar call and you know my husband and I of course we got up because you know uh, we wanted to pray for our friends and family that are still not saved. And so uh, while I was up there, you know, I had grabbed a friend of mine's hand, Rachel, calling you by name. <laughs> and she like shook my hand loose. And when she did that, you know, it caused me to open my eyes. And, and I looked and that's when I saw, hey, Summer's at the altar too. And so I went over there to her and um, she was still crying very hard. And she, uh, she was holding uh, my baby. <laughs> very loud. Um, she was holding um, Pastor Greg's wife's hand really hard and another lady's wife's hand. No, another lady, not wife, another lady's hand. And no, go, 
go in your room with that. <laughs> Sorry. And um, <clears throat> yeah, so I wasn't about to break that up. So I just wrapped my arms around her. <laughs> and, you know, we just stood there and prayed. And, you know, um, he asked who wanted to accept salvation. And, and you know, she raised her hand. So that was awesome. And um, so then, yeah, after uh, we did the altar call, we went to the back and, uh, you know, they asked who, who accepted salvation and everything. And then, um, yeah, we came back out and, yeah, it was awesome. I was <laughs> like, wow, like how long have I been praying for this? <laughs> like to just see my prayers answered in that way was just amazing. And then... Um, so after church, uh, my husband and I and a couple of our friends, Reggie and Julie, we uh, all went to lunch with them, uh, including Daniel, because he had ridden with them and he accepted salvation too, as I told you. And so, um, yeah, we went to lunch. And then after lunch, um, SL and uh, Daniel left to go do some work. And uh, Summer and the kids uh, ended up coming back to our house. Uh, no. Sorry, my baby's spoiled, very spoiled. So let's just keep it quiet <laughs> until I finish this video. So anyway, um, so yeah, uh, she ended up coming back to our house with the kids, which is something that I had like been dreaming about for years. And so it finally happened this past Sunday and that was awesome. And then got to see her um, again. Oh, that, that Sunday, stop, Sunday, um, stop, there's nothing in there, that's not going to come out, I'm sorry you guys, I was trying to make this video short, but I have so much going on with kids and everything, so, um, yes, so she came back to our house and we got to talk for a little while and talk about, you know, stuff that's been going on with her, I guess, in the last year. And then um, we went back to evening service. Tim Lee was there again and preached. And then we got to see her again, or I should say I got to see her again. I and the ladies at our church got to see her again on uh, Tuesday night um, because we have the ladies fellowship up there. And so that was really nice to see her there. And hopefully I'll get to see her again this coming Sunday. So yeah. <laughs> It's been quite a whirlwind of a week, and, you know, I just wanted to thank you guys, share that testimony with you, and also thank you guys for your prayers, because I know, you know, some of you guys out there have been burdened, as I have been, in praying for her, and I ask that you also continue to pray for her husband, and so that he would also, you know, accept salvation, and, um, also pray uh, for the rest of the group that they would also uh, see a need for salvation and accept salvation too. So, all right, you guys, uh, that's about it. Uh, I have a thousand things to do today and children over there making noise. So I will let you guys go and talk to you soon. All right, bye.